What is going on guys? It is Fatal Reaper Day bringing you guys a video. We are jumping straight into it. We are on the HP Pavilion Gaming Laptop. Be sure to hit the like button and subscribe as always. In this today's video we're doing a uh, the video is can Vanguard run on the HP Pavilion or can the HP Pavilion uh, you know handle Vanguard so I've done many tests on Vanguard I've done like three or four I even did it when the beta came out but I did get some uh, questions recently is hey my Vanguard's not running can you do another Vanguard test uh, I wasn't going to because I've done so many but uh, since it's such a popular question and I've gotten it quite a few times I decided I'm gonna go ahead and jump on there and do it again uh, you know with all updates all the new updates that come out frequently you know games can get more demanding with those updates so I wanted to make sure that the pavilion could still run Vanguard smoothly now I do recommend first of all on your settings and display and quality have all your settings on low I know it sucks but have all your settings on low for the HP pavilion and turn vSync on you don't have to but I highly recommend tur excuse me turning it on vSync is just it's going to run better, it's going to run more fluidly, and you're always going to get that 60 FPS. As you can see, FPS counter is in the left corner. Um, I went ahead and played, and I was skeptical at first, you know, with all these new updates and everything like that. Again, games can get more demanding, so I was a little bit worried for the HP Pavilion on this one again. Uh, however, the gameplay was completely smooth. I had no issues. As you can see, even with low settings, the game still looks really good, especially on a laptop. I mean, in this, in, in this day and age, uh, with things getting more and more... Uh, progressed and everything like that and more demanding especially games uh you know i just decided you know uh i mean it, it still runs great i mean i don't have any issues the gameplay is just solid it was smooth i was actually a little shocked of how smooth it really was because i was thinking i was probably going to run into some lag or anything like that now it is uh good to note that i do have 16 gigs of ram in my build and i do play with an ethernet cord when i do these videos so when i do these videos or i'm playing in general I do use an Ethernet cord, and what an Ethernet cord is, I do have a video on that if you guys want to see that. It provides you a good, stable internet connection with no issues whatsoever, typically, especially if you have good internet, um, and you'll probably never run into really lags or disconnects or anything like that. You'll typically just have a smooth gameplay. That being said, guys, again, Vanguard here has ran completely fluidly, so can the HP Pavilion still handle Vanguard? Um, yes, 100%. I mean, it plays without any issues at all, as you can see here. Um, again, 16 gigs of RAM in this build. If you don't have 16 gigs of RAM, you can buy the 8 gigabyte RAM stick that I have in the description of my videos. Uh, that is the one that I did, in fact, buy and put in this build. And uh, it does help overall and definitely does improve at least the, uh, the system as a whole. Uh, that being said, guys, I will be doing a video when Modern Warfare 2, uh, which is I'm really, really excited for that. When that comes out, um, we'll be doing a video on that, see if the pavilion can handle it. I, sh I mean, it should be able to still play. I wouldn't think that it wouldn't be able to handle it. Uh, we're going to find out and see. Uh, we're going to do a video on that. Uh, Resident Evil 4 Remake, one of my favorite games of all time for survival horror games. I'm definitely going to be doing that when it comes out, which that's a year away. So that's that's a big, that's uh, that's a lot of time, uh, especially for Modern Warfare 2. I'm not 100% sure when Modern Warfare 2 uh, Remake will be coming out. When that comes out, though, we will uh, we'll be doing a video on that. Uh, when they introduce Warzone 2, I keep hearing about a lot about Warzone 2. We're going to be doing videos on that on the HP Pavilion still, and then just other videos in general. That being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you have any questions or anything about the uh, game of the HP Pavilion, just let me know down in the comments, and I'll be sure to get back to you as fast as possible. If you want to see different games, just let me know, and I will try to get to them. Um, been doing a lot of other videos on the Pavilion and other things. Uh, not related to the Pavilion 2 on the YouTube channel. So appreciate all of you guys that stopped by, like, subscribe, support the channel. Uh, see you guys next video. Thanks for watching. Again, see you in the next one. Spy the sky. <sighs> We're down, but not down. <laughs> uh. Contact at the hard point. Contact sure at the hard point. Hard point activated. 